Hi, I'm Peyton, and I'm from Kinsley, Kansas. How you ended up coming out here to Oklahoma to work with me? Um, I saw you on TikTok. What were some skills that you were doing or you're struggling with before coming out here? Definitely my standing tuck, connecting back handsprings to my round off and anything else to my back handspring. So we did a, we did a round off handspring tuck today. How long has it been since you've done that? Years, I don't even remember the you last You can't even time. remember the last time that you did it. And you've tried or you've attempted to do it with coaches, like with multiple different coaches telling you, hey, do your round off back handspring back tuck, I'm gonna spot you in the tuck. You just couldn't get yourself to do it. What was the difference then today? Why did you do it today? took a breather and looked at it differently than just do it. My favorite part of today was whenever you did your handspring tuck and we had your mom stand there. Yeah. And for anybody watching this, her mom's not just like a random mom that I had to her spot her on her tuck. Like they actually, they own a gym. Her mom's a gymnastics tumbling coach, so she knows what she's doing. The formula stays the same, right? It doesn't matter if I'm standing there, it doesn't matter if your mom is standing there, round off back handspring, rebound, kick your knees and pull. Don't change the formula and you won't have a different outcome. Let's go. There you go, look at that, doing a handsfree tuck with your mama. When did you ever think that was going to happen? Never for the rest of your life? Good job, and that was a good spot. Did you feel like your mom would ever be able to spot you again, like, for the rest of your life? No? That was really cool. I'm glad that you did that. Yeah. Have, have you worked on anything that you've never worked on before? A full. Yeah? Woo! That was nice. How was that? Talk about that experience. Good. It was fun. Yeah. Go back to Kansas and try it. So. Yeah, good.